time, turn to more of your top stories. Dozens of senior citizens have been forced out of their apartments after a water pipe burst there. Happened on the second floor of the Cottonwood Senior Apartments. That's in Placerville. Well, that entire building has been deemed uninhabitable for the time being. ABC 10's Monica Coleman is live in studio with us this morning with how this impacts those residents. Monica? Good morning. Many Cottonwood Senior Apartment residents are waking up at a Best Western this morning with no idea when they can return to their homes. The apartment complex issuing a mandatory evacuation following the busted pipe. Yesterday, the El Dorado County Fire Protection District worked around the clock to contain the water, but the damage was done to 40 to 45 units on the first and second floors. Initially, only 25 people were evacuated. Then hours later, the damage got worse and safety crews evacuated the entire complex. Placerville Police says the city is working with the property management company to make sure the 77 seniors displaced are at a local hotel or with a family member. The question remains, what caused the line to break? Placerville Police Chief said it's too early to tell. Looking at some photos, it does not appear to be tampered with. I suspect it's thousands of gallons. Um, I know crews on scene brought squeegees to the scene just to sweep out as much physically that they could do, um, just mechanically pushing the water from the structure. Uh, it's going to take a professional cleaning agency to come in there uh, and mitigate the rest of that. That's a carpeted structure in the hallways and, and inside the units. The Red Cross is helping residents displaced and will continue to provide them with lunch and dinner today and tomorrow. The city building department will conduct a more thorough inspection today. Again, there's no timeline when the seniors will be able to move back in. All right, well, we hope it's not too long. Everybody doesn't like to be away yeah. from home too long. All right, Monica, thank you.